Welcome, welcome, welcome. You are broadcasting live with the professional black sorcerer, the Prince of Darkness, Coleo Giovanni. Yes, indeed. Now, the very first thing you need to do is get into a altered state of consciousness. Rub your hands together. Get them nice and warm and visualize peace, prosperity, and abundance. Dark energy and light energy. Get them warm and then rub them all around your body. Permeate yourself with that energy. Learn to relax. Keep your mind focused on what the outcome of the ritual is going to be. Make sure you cast a spell upon your own altar. May the ancestors grant me peace, prosperity, and abundance. May the ancestors take care of the mighty, mighty B.I.O.S. tribe. May the ancestors give nothing but love and protection and abundance to each and every one of y'all that support me on social media from Facebook to YouTube to all the way on down. Yes, indeed, I love each and every one of y'all. May the ancestors watch over us all. Keep us all safe as we go forward on this black Illuminati thing that we got going on here. Yes, indeed. Concentrate. Concentrate very deeply. Make sure you concentrate. Visualizing exactly what it is that you want to manifest. See it, feel it, and become it. Allow your mind. Allow your mind to open itself up. Remember, anytime you do a ritual, the ritual is already done. You cannot conceive of anything that hasn't already taken place in the astral realm. But in order for you to make it manifest here on planet Earth, planet Gaia, a.k.a. Terrestis, you have to put ample ritual energy into it. You've got to put your thoughts, words, actions, and emotions in alignment with the things that you're doing. You have to stay in alignment. Various herb blends. Use bay leaves. Money draw oil. Green candles, red candles, papa leg by sigils. Keep yourself in the spirit of abundance. Always channel and focus your energy exactly. And I mean exactly on what you are manifesting. Keep your thoughts, words, actions, and emotions in alignment. The ritual happens in the way you lived your life before you cast it the spell. You have to already move in the spirit of someone that is capable, someone that is qualified, someone that believes in they self and qualifies their goddamn self to be able to do witchcraft. When you live in the spirit of being that type of person, when you cast the spell, it's going to work. And when you cast the spell, make sure that you forget about it when it's done. Let it flow. Let that energy flow and it will land. This is just part one. I'm going to share the hidden secrets of this glamour magic, this melanin magic. Ha, 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 ha,